Let's face it, network switches are pretty boring. I mean, it's rare that a vendor comes out with a network switch that has some innovative and exciting new features. You know, something that sets it apart from all of the other network switches on the market. Well, it seems that Ubiquiti has done just that, which is why I was pretty excited to check out their new Pro Max switches. On the surface, they're pretty standard. They have four Pro Max switch models, 24 ports with or without PoE, and 48 ports with or without PoE. At the time I'm recording this, the PoE enabled switches are gonna be arriving first with the non-PoE versions coming in just a few weeks. One third of the ethernet ports in each model switch are 2.5 gigabit, meaning eight ports of 2.5 gigabit in the 24 port switches and 16 ports of 2.5 gigabit in the 48 port models. The balance of the ports are one gigabit and these switches also have 10 gigabit SFP plus cages. Again, all pretty standard, though I'm sure that many of the naysayers out there are gonna complain that all of the ports should be 2.5 gigabit. So then what makes these switches special? Pro Max switches feature a new concept called ether lighting. Every single switch port has full color spectrum LEDs behind it that can be configured to provide some pretty intuitive visual switch management. With ether lighting, you can change the LED color of individual switch ports based on the speed of the port or based on the native VLAN assigned to that port. Let's take a closer look at these features in Unify. So I'm on the early access version of Unify here in my test network version 8.0.24. If I click on devices and then select the Pro Max 24 PoE switch, and then I click on settings here on the right, we can see the ether lighting section. By default, ether lighting is set to show you the speed of each interface. In this case, fast ethernet is yellow, Gigabit is red, 2.5 gigabit is blue, and 10 gigabit is white. If you click on any of these options, you can actually select the specific LED color that you want for each different speed. You can then choose network, which changes the LED on each switch port to the native VLAN of that specific port. And again, you can customize the color of your VLANs. Now to me, this is the killer option. Being able to see a switch port's native VLANs at a glance can go a long way towards troubleshooting issues or just not making mistakes by plugging devices into the wrong VLAN. Additionally, if you click into the port manager in Unify, you can use the locate function to find where a specific device is plugged in. This feature disables all port LEDs except for the one that you're looking for, which is gonna be pulsing blue. This also works on a per device level if you click on any unified device and then click locate under settings. So imagine you've got an access point or a protect camera that's you know way up on a ceiling or hanging on the wall somewhere and you need to figure out which port that device is plugged into. This is gonna make it super easy to find without having to manually trace those cables. Really, really cool feature. Now this is definitely a wow factor in terms of network switching. Some folks forget that these switches also have an AR feature to see switch information and which devices are plugged into which ports. But and that's a cool feature, but like to me it's more of a gimmick than something actually useful. Ether lighting, however, I can see as being actually useful, which is definitely a bonus. So with these Pro Max switches, you get 10 gig SFPs, 2.5 gig ports, PoE Plus and PoE Plus Plus on the PoE models, and now ether lighting to help with your visual at a glance network administration. Super cool. Ubiquity has also released new designed for ether lighting patch cables meant to enhance the brightness and clarity of ether lighting ports. Now I wasn't able to get my hands on any of these new ether lighting patch cables at the time that I'm recording this, but I will absolutely do a follow up video showcasing how those work once I have them in hand. And as always, I am happy to provide my unsolicited feedback to Ubiquity on how these features could be improved even more. So first, I'd love to see a show VLANs or show port speeds option in Unify 
and also accessible through the settings of the 1.3 inch display screen on the Switch itself. The notion being that when you hit that button, all of the empty Switch ports would light up with either their port speed or native VLAN information, making it super easy to decide where to patch in a device. Now second, in the Unify VLAN Manager, native VLANs show up as blue and untagged VLANs show up as green. This could potentially be confusing if for some reason you decided to use those same colors for ether lighting. So in the VLAN Manager, there should be some sort of indication of which ether lighting colors are used for which VLAN. Similarly, the port speed colors in the port manager should be synchronized with the ether lighting port colors that you set. All right, so what do you guys think about these new Pro Max switches? Is ether lighting a feature that you want in your own network? Let me know down in the comments below. And if you'd like to keep this party going, I have hand selected a couple of videos on the right here for you to watch next. The top video is my recent overview of everything that's new in Unify 8.0.7. And the bottom video is my review of Unify Express, a compact network gateway with Unify Network built right in.